that intro will never not be nostalgic what is up guys my name is cody and today we're playing black ops 1. now just recently microsoft went back and fixed all the servers for all the old call of duty games on xbox meaning on xbox 360 xbox one xbox series x whatever xbox you can hop on and play the old Call of Duty games without having to worry about any hackers, any lag issue, anything like that. And so right now, as we speak, there are over 230,000 people playing this game right now. That is absolutely fucking mental. All right, I'm just super excited to get right into it, so let's do it. Oh God, oh God, the game is breaking. What is happening? Let me play! Please, let me play. Let's go, baby. Dude, firing range was such a classic. Bro, you don't even understand. I am so pumped up and excited right now. I want to relive the vibes of 2010 again. Here we go, baby. This is so good. Oh my gosh, brother. Off and diving. Oh my god. Now, just to let you guys know, I was always a Treyarch guy. I was always a Treyarch kid growing up. Like, sure, I did play the MW series, and I do have nostalgic feels for the MW series, especially when you hear that good old MW2 soundtrack. But I love the zombies game mode that Treyarch provided. And so the zombies basically made me a Treyarch guy. Dude, the kills and the sound effects for the pop-ups are so nice. God, dude, I just, I can't stop. This feels so good. Oh my god, can I get up the ladder? God, dude, the sounds are just so clean. Like, what happened? Nowadays, everything just feels so rushed and unpolished and just not creative at all. <laughs> the guy's got a little Yoshi emblem. It just felt like back then there was so much passion for this stuff, but there's just not anymore. Woo! The ladders are my worst enemy in this game. No! <laughs> Man just got fucked by a claymore. <laughs> Bro, I'm having way too much fun right now. <laughs> Bop. Damn it! Bro! It did not- my shot did not trigger at all. That's some bull. God, like, the, the calls of the announcer are so good. Oh, that was a bad idea. Bro, the classic dolphin diving. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> oh Jesus. Oh Jesus. Bro, I'm actually having way more fun than I should be right now. Who knew that just reviving an old classic and actually going back and fixing it can make life so much better? Damn it! <laughs> oh my god, you camper, bro. I'm gonna see if I can snipe him. Oh wow, oh wow, this is weird. Hit marker, really? Damn it. Nice. What the fuck? Bro, the claymores! Come on! Bro, Jesus Christ. See, and with, at least with this game, you actually have team names. You actually have creative names for the teams. It's not just called my team and enemy team, like another Call of Duty. And the final kill cams in this game are just so good. God, dude, just simple menus like this, I'm just super appreciative of, and I miss so much. Bro, Hondi, I remember this map. Bro, I used to play hide and seek on this map all the time. I want to stay. I want to play some Hondi. Please, someone join. Come on. No! Let me relive my childhood, damn it. God damn it, fine. If it puts me in the exact same lobby. Nope, we're Gucci. 
jungle, baby. Oh my god, it's so weird playing this map again after playing in like Black Ops 4 and Cold War, some of the newer COD titles. Ooh! Yeah, but nah, it's pretty funny actually because I was watching some Phase Jeb, which shout out to him. He's what actually got me to make this video and play some of the older Call of Duties. The man said he literally went out and bought a Series X and a couple old Call of Duty games to play them. And that's some dedication right there. Man's literally went out and bought a whole Xbox and a couple of games just to make videos on the old Call of Duties again. That's how much of a gem these games are and how amazing that they are. Yeah, Microsoft definitely needed to go back and fix the old Call of Duty servers. What in the hell is this attack helicopter? Oh my god. Bro, that was such a quick match. Wow, what a kill cam. Also, that is a very, you know, underrated feature in these games is the random selection button, the map voting. That map voting is such a huge and crucial thing to the game that it just isn't there anymore. And also the disbanding lobbies, get that the hell out of here. I want to play with the exact same people I played with last match. Whether that's me, you know, pissing people off or making some good friends. Get that shit out of your Activision. Bro, this music is a vibe. I could just sit in the lobby. Let's get her going, baby. <laughs> Dude, I'm having so much fun. Bro, that intro will never get old. God, I remember back on these old games on the 360 PS3 when people had clan tags in their actual <laughs> name, in their gamer tag. Hit marker? Bro, that's bait. HK21? I'll take you. One thing that you can definitely tell is that the movement on this game is very slow. Especially if you play the newer games. No wonder people are such sweats nowadays. Bro, they can slide cancel all the way across the goddamn country. The goddamn continent, that. That's a grenade! Ah! Ripping chat, bro. No! Bro, a man just camping in the corner! Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, God. Bro! There's no mounting in this game. God, look at those textures. So good. I was about to say that flashbang did nothing. But then I just saw what? Damn! Oh, my God. Have I won a single game yet? <laughs> Okay, that was pretty badass. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> he just called him the drop shotting bitch. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I don't. Crisis? I don't remember Crisis. Enough with the firing range. Let's play a different map, please. Gamer fuel. I swear to god. Nope, not again. Oh baby, we are on the classic Nuketown using the Galil. What in the hell is happening with that bike? God, I just played this map on Black Ops 3 not too long ago. Now we're on the classic, the first one ever. But yeah, no, back then we didn't, you know, really have custom frame rates, field of view sliders. It was just this and you had to deal with it. Bro, these games are ending so fast. I'm joining them mid-match. But hey, at least we won this one. Bro, these kill cams never get old. I forgot Nuketown had a custom end screen. That was actually pretty cool. That was definitely the funnest I've had playing a Call of Duty in uh, quite a while.